The Insight Meditation Teachings Cultivating Insight and Wisdom Through Meditation The Buddha was a spiritual teacher who lived in India over 2,500 years ago. His teachings show us how to end suffering and find true happiness. The heart of the Buddha's teaching is the Four Noble Truths. The first noble truth is that life is suffering. This doesn't mean that life is bad all the time. But it does mean that suffering is a part of life. There is suffering when things don't go the way we want them to. There is suffering when we lose someone we love. And there is suffering when we get sick or grow old. The second noble truth is that the cause of suffering is craving. We suffer because we crave things that we can't have, or because we don't have things that we crave. We may crave money, success, or love. Or we may crave food, drink, or cigarettes. The third noble truth is that suffering can be ended. The way to end suffering is to end craving. This doesn't mean that we will never feel pain or loss. But it does mean that we can be free from the suffering that comes from craving. The fourth noble truth is that there is a path to the end of suffering. This path is called the Eightfold Path. It is a path of mindfulness, wisdom, and compassion. The Eightfold Path is the way to end suffering and find true happiness. It is a path of mindfulness, wisdom, and compassion. The path begins with mindfulness. Mindfulness means being aware of our thoughts, feelings, and actions in the present moment. It means paying attention to our breath and the sensations in our body. Mindfulness helps us to see the things that cause us to suffer. The path also includes wisdom. Wisdom is understanding the Four Noble Truths. It is seeing things as they really are. Wisdom is knowing that things are not permanent. And it is knowing that we can't have everything we want. The path also includes compassion. Compassion is caring about others. It is wanting to end their suffering. Compassion is the heart of the Buddha's teaching. The path of mindfulness, wisdom, and compassion leads to true happiness. This is the end of suffering.